Embalming is a phenomenon that has existed for thousands of years but how these mummies with different techniques are made and the components in them are still unclear. Today we think that the mummification is the most used by the Egyptians. But this is inaccurate information. Many ancient communities such as Korn use the technique of mummification. This is due to the fact that the body of the deceased can maintain its existence for a long time. Thus, the body of the deceased could remain intact for much longer. One of the most special of the mummies today, known as Sleeping Beauty for 101 years and literally intact in almost no way as of 2019 has been the first day in 101 years. Using a very different mummification technique, the person who embalmed this girl had taken her secret to the grave, and for this reason it was not possible to find out which components were used. But in the light of recent research, it was now found out what these components are and how they are used. The Sleeping Beauty is in a glass coffin for 101 years. What is the life story of this little boy standing intact? Welcome to the channel of Secrets of the Past, the life story of Rosalia Lombardo, who has been Sleeping Beauty for 101 years. My daughter died because of a disease that is a variant of the H1N1 virus, known as the Spanish flu, at the age of two, when she was a little child. This disease took 25 million people in Europe at the time. My daughter died because her father couldn't handle it. He decided to mummify and went to the man who used the most famous animal stuffing and mummification technique of his time when his father wanted to perform this burdensome job because he was an Italian general. Dr. Alfredo Salafia put the girl in a glass coffin, but until now, it was not clear what kind of method and components it used. Piombino Maskell, who incidentally found a manuscript, researched for years by scientists and archaeologists to figure out how the embalming technique of Sleeping Beauty was on display at a museum in Palermo, Italy. It is known that this manuscript contains detailed information about how this little girl embalms. Thus, his body had been standing in such a beautiful way without any deterioration for years. However, in the course of further research, the liquid found in his veins was embalmed with a mixture of glycerin zinc and chlorine salicylic acid. This mixture was properly preserved as the first day of the death of the little girls. There are those who believe that he is still alive. This situation is all about the eyes reflected from glass to coffin. People are exposed to such an illusion because of the refraction of light. My little girl claims that she blinked from time to time. However, in accordance with the researches, it was concluded that the eyes of the younger girl were not completely closed, that is, her eyes were not fully closed even when she was embalmed. 